Hi guys, welcome to another episode of my Sims 2 Pleasant View Let's Play. Today we are playing the Broke Family in the trailer over here with Brandy, um, Bo, and Braxton. Bo, um, Bro, Bo and Braxton are both teenagers. I think they're both going to be aging up if I remember correctly. I don't really remember. I know Bo for sure, but I'm not sure about um, Braxton. But we'll find out. We'll play them now. Um, I wanted to take them out on a sort of like a camping trip, maybe like a weekend camping trip. I think that'd be cute. And then um, Brandy, I don't know if she's pregnant or not, um, because in the last episode, remember, she woohooed with Darian uh, at um, Gigi's birthday, or Gigi or Jaslyn's birthday, one of those two. I think it was Gigi's birthday. <laughs> um, but we're just going to get right into it, and uh, let's, uh, let's play the Broke Family. Okay, here we are with Brandy, Bo, and Braxton. Um, Bo will be aging up in two days, and Braxton will be aging up in nine. So Braxton is not even close. I don't even know what I was thinking. <laughs> um, but Brandy wants to uh, flirt and be with Darren. That's uh, annoying. And then uh, Bo wants to uh, go out with Carol, his girlfriend, and be friends with Susie, their new puppy that they just got. And they also, he also wants to go to college and grow up well, but he needs to decide what he wants to do. Braxton has a want to win the extraterrestrial reparations grant. Oh my god, I bought them a telescope. <laughs> so I guess we're going to try to get him abducted by aliens so he can win that grant, because that's what this, uh, that's how you get it. <laughs> Brandy works in the architecture career. She is currently in the level four of the career. Um, she makes $450 an, a day, um, she has work today, her sons have school today, um, and then I think when they come back, I'm gonna let them go on a, on a trip, a mountain trip, because I want them to go camping, um, and just have, like, a weekend where she just takes her boys out on a camping trip before Bo leaves, so I'm gonna do that, um, when they get back, all of them. I mean, I think I can do that. It shouldn't be too expensive. I mean, oh, never mind. It's going to be a bit expensive because of the uh, tickets. Hmm. Maybe we can just take a loan. I want to do it before uh, Bo leaves, so I'll just loan a bunch of money for tickets. We'll see how much it costs when she comes home. All right, there she goes. Off to work. Oh, Susie just grew up into a puppy. <laughs> She's cute. Now that Susie is a big dog, now we can get her... Um, now we can get her a collar. We'll have to do that um, at some point. All right, Bo's got an A minus now, and Braxton has now got a B because he just doesn't want to do his homework at all. Which um, he can do that now if he wants to do some of it. Um, but I'm gonna take care of their needs uh, so then when they leave, um, they're uh, ready for that uh, trip. Oh, Brandy got a promotion. Oh, that's actually really nice because now we can probably afford tickets pretty easily. Um, so let's see if we can get some, uh, plane tickets so we can get out of here. Um, we're gonna do a... What is it? Vacation? Book a vacation. We're gonna take the boys out on a vacation. We'll go now for three days and two nights. We're gonna take Bo and Braxton. 1500 Holy crap. Um, I might have to loan her some money. <laughs> um, and we will accept this. We're gonna go to Three Lakes. And then we'll go to the, the campgrounds because it's free to stay there. They don't have to go to any of the resorts or anything. So we're going to go to the campground for free uh, fun time. And I think I'm just going to loan $1,000 anyway. Um, just so we have some money. So Brandy's going to have negative amount of money. Um, which is fine because we'll pay it back. And uh, Bo will be aging up next time when we come back. Or next or tomorrow. The next day we will be here. Our shuttle has arrived. Let's go. I'm just gonna go for a little mountain vacation. Just the three of them. Boys trip with their mom. Oh boy, Brandy's just scared to have a baby. <laughs> this is another reason why she's telling me she does not want to have babies anymore. She's like, I'm good with my boys. <laughs> Alright, here we are at the campground. Um, I don't know. I don't think we have to... Uh... Oh, we have to check in. Maybe we'll take, uh, two tents. Okay, we can use any tent. Okay, it doesn't matter. We can use any of them. Alright, so the boys can use whatever tents they want. Um, no one wants to do anything except Brandy wants to learn the local gesture. I'm surprised that, uh, no one wants to do anything. I guess I'll just let them do whatever they want. We, we've come on vacation to do pillow fights with each other. 
Oh, Brittany wants to talk to me about Braxton. This is so cute. This is like her. She's like, I want to hang out with my son. She should want to hang out with Bo, too. Like, come on, he's going to be leaving you. Alright, it looks like Brandy's gonna go tuck in in the tent, and the boys are over here eating flapjacks. <laughs> Pancakes. What did you order? Charboiled catfish. Braxton. That sounds pretty, uh, interesting. Brandy's just relaxing in the tent. She's just sitting over here. And the boys are playing axe throwing. <laughs> hey, be careful with that. Oh, Braxton's actually good! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, careful! He dropped it. Oh my god, this girl, Opal, Opal Ramon, just tried to flirt with Braxton, and Braxton's like, um, step off, girl. <laughs> She's got two bolts with her. Dang. He's like, uh, no, I don't, I'm not interested. Thank you very much. <laughs> Let's take a shower. I think we should probably pack in for the night. The boys are really, really tired. Maybe they can both have this one. The boys get their own ten over here, and Brandy got her own one. I think Brandy would want the, uh, the privacy. Oh, Brandy's thinking about flirting with Darren. Of course, I will let you do that when you get home. But you're not home right now. You have to wait. He didn't come with you, Brandy. <laughs> but once I go on a tour, I think that's a good idea. We can uh, take him on a tour. And Brandy's fishing. This is a good idea. But once they gain a skill point... Oh, okay. You can't really do much here. Can we, uh, jump rope and earn one? No. Okay, well then I'll hang on to the skill points. I'd rather, uh, hang on to the skill point and earn that when we get home. I'll take you on a tour today, and then maybe we can travel to a, a vacation place. Oh, Braxton's making hot dogs. Ah, uh, hot dogs at four in the morning. <laughs> How much is a tour for three people? <laughs> Let's go on a logging expedition. That would be fun. $100 per person. All right, fair enough. 300 bucks. Let's go, guys. Hopefully it uh, doesn't end terribly. <laughs> Can't spend too much money because we don't we didn't have too much to bring, unfortunately. But uh, maybe I'll take him to a local destination afterwards. As the expedition begins, clearing the logging trees, the family of beavers emerges from the river. Angry about all the chopping, should the group offer the beavers food to appease them or try to scare them away with loud noises? Let's give them food. Beavers quickly forget about the trees as they see the food, munching happily as they watch the expedition make its way down the river. Everyone gains a logic skill point. Oh, nice. <gasps> Brandy said this is absolutely perfect. I can't wait to come back. Oh. All right. Let's uh walk to a lot. Let's go to a community lot with the boys. Let's see what's around here. Um there's a park, there's a plaza. Um we can go to the lumber mill range. Actually, that's a good idea. Let's go there. Alrighty, Here we are at the lumber mill. Brandy is over here log rolling away. Careful, Brandy. Oh. It's always so cute when they use that. Um, and then we have Bo and Braxton just standing around wanting to talk to Sebastian. Braxton just doesn't care. He's like, I want to earn some money. I don't want to do anything else. <laughs> okay, Brandy, that's enough of that. You're getting really tired. Let's go on another tour. I would love to take him on another tour, but I don't know how. It's going to be really expensive. I'll let the boys hang out here a little bit longer. Brandy's getting really- she's really, really tired from log rolling, so... I'm gonna um, let them do whatever they want for a bit, and then we will head out. It's letting the boys play around on the log roller. Oh, Braxton sucks. <laughs> Bo just laughing at him. He's like, ha ha ha. Let's see if we can knock him off. Nope. <laughs> I just wanted to do it for a little bit. Then they can do whatever they want. All right, Brandy's on the verge of passing out, so I'm gonna take them home now. I let them do whatever they wanted for a bit. Um, they just had some fun. They didn't really do too much. They were just chatting and dancing, so we'll just go back now. Yep, yep, I know, Brandy, you're about to pass out, so why don't you get in and go to bed? We'll just take a nap in the tent, and the boys will go eat some chicken pot pie, and Rex is gonna have some catfish. All right, don't get struck by lightning now, though. <laughs> That's the bad thing about camping, is you're out in the middle of all of this uh, weather. All right, and another day has passed. Um, I'm gonna let them rest up, because they are really, really exhausted. That's kind of gross, having Opal outside their tent just eating and belching. 
Nice to see the kids making friends on their uh, vacation here. <laughs> they only have one more day left, but I think I'm just gonna spend it here, and they're just gonna do whatever they want. Um, they don't have any wants to do anything, like, vacation-wise, so they'll probably just, like I said, hang out, do whatever they want here, and then uh, we'll head out tomorrow, and we'll go home, and, uh, we'll work on stuff at home. I'm, I really like that Bo and Braxton are really close. Brandy still has that fear of having a baby. She really does not want to have a baby anymore. <laughs> She's really letting me know. Time flies when we're having fun. We only have one day left. Yep, I know. We gotta go. We're just gonna stay here and do whatever we want. Where did everyone go? Brandy's just sitting in a chair. And Braxton is ordering some food. He's ordering more flapjacks. And Bo ordered a pot pie. Oh my god, now Brandy's needs are all about Darren, or wants, I mean, her wants are all about Darren, she wants to invite him over and romance him, oh my god. <laughs> Man, it is pouring out here again. <laughs> Thunderstorms, crazy. Every day Brandy rolls the fear to have a baby. I, I really never have ever had her roll fears to have babies. <laughs> This is weird. All right, we're ready to check out. We checked out, we can check back in if we want. No, we're gonna end the vacation. It's time to go home, boys. They had a nice, lovely vacation, uh, like a over the weekend vacation. It didn't cost Brandy too much other than the plane tickets. <laughs> but now it is time to go. I hope they had fun. Alrighty, everyone is home and um, I give everyone their vacation benefits. And now we are going to uh, relax a little. Mm -hmm. Bo does not have the want to go to college right now. Let's talk to Braxton about a hobby. Maybe he'll change his mind. There it is. All right, we'll keep the college one. And he'll go to college instead. Because I count that if any time they roll the want on the last day, um, he gets to have it. And that counts as long as it says one day. It might be a little too late, but I'm gonna see if I can invite Darren over because she's thinking about Darren and wants to flirt with him. So maybe I can get him to uh, be here for a second. All right, she didn't want to do anything too crazy. All her wants are pretty friendly, like. Oh, and now he's leaving. All right, well that that didn't that wasn't too eventful. <laughs> Guys, let's go to bed. Oh my God, Braxton wants to get a job in the medicine career. I can't lock in Bo. Can I try to find it right now? Darn, I want to lock in that too because that'd be kind of cool, but oh well. I think the, the grant is a little bit more uh, better for him than it is uh, for the uh, job. Alright, Braxton, let's go. Time for school. The boys didn't do any of their homework, so they're not going to have good grades uh, today. Braxton's going to go down to a C, and then Bo will go down to a B. When Bo comes home, he'll be moving to college. He'll apply for scholarships, and uh, if he applies for any, then he'll get some money. And then if he doesn't, well, then he'll just go. Oh, Bo got 250 bucks. Okay, well then we can put those in his bank account. Uh, well, at least 200 bucks. Apply for scholarships? No, we don't, we don't apply for any. Okay, well then we'll just move to college. Brandy won't be home in time. Well, actually she will, but we'll just move Bo out now. I think he would want to just get out of here now. Here, answer the phone. Is Brandy available to talk? No, Dina. She's gone. Um, so we have to move him in on four days left in summer. So let me wrote, write that down. So he will be a part of the summer round, but he will move in on the fourth day um, with Tessa. Brandy's home. <laughs> I need to give her a job stopinator because she cannot actually get any more, um, she's not allowed any more, um, promotions. So we'll do that. Looks like one of the boys brought home Cassidy, so Cassidy's hanging out for a bit. We'll let Braxton uh, look through the telescope tonight and see if we'll get abducted by aliens. I don't know if it'll work, but we'll try. Alright, let's get some leftovers. We have some food left over in here. Um, we got some bills to pay. Why is Darren here? Did he just decide to stop over? Okay, Darren. <laughs> Alright. Well, thanks for stopping over, I guess. Yep, they're gonna go relax. <laughs> oh my god. Braxton's like, I'm sorry, Cassidy. This is very awkward. Alright, let's go stargaze, Braxton. Good luck. We're also going to uh, get rid of Bo's bed because we don't need it anymore. Oh, my dog is chewing something, so 
Here, let's go for destroying the furniture. Oh, Braxton got upset by that. So now he's in the negative, which sucks, but... We're trying to get that, uh... Extraterrestrial grant for him. Alright, well, I had him look for a while, and he didn't, uh... He didn't get anything, so I'm gonna let him go to sleep and rest, because he's got school in, like, an hour. <laughs> So I'm gonna let him rest up as best as much as he can. Oh yeah, we gotta get Susie a collar. We also need to give her a bath because she stinks. We'll have to do that when we come back. All right, let's go to school and work. Braxton grades are improving, which is good. I'm gonna keep him around the B range, you know, unless he wants to do really well in school. He wants to get into private school. I will try, but. Oh my god, scold the dog for destroying the furniture. No, he wants to get a painting, sell a masterpiece. You don't really have that many uh, creativity skill points. Here, let's nap up, and then we'll try to get abducted again tonight. Alrighty, it's late at night. We're gonna go back to stargazing and try to get this uh, extraterrestrial reparations grant. And I guess we can try to invite the headmaster and see if he'll um, allow Braxton to get into private school. We'll do that, um, we'll do that now, and then he'll come over tomorrow at 5. And they'll be off, both of them, so. They'll both have a chance to, uh, rest up. Normally I wouldn't do it to my poor sims, but maybe they might make an exception. It might be a bit difficult. And still no abduction. This is kind of difficult for Braxton. Well, the two of them don't have, uh, work in their school, so we can hang out with each other. Um, maybe we'll have Brandy go down to the pet store and get, um, Susie, uh, collar. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna have, uh, Brandy walk down to the pet store and grab, uh, a collar for Susie so we can get that done for her. Alright, let's go buy a collar. Oh, get a collar for her. And then we are going to walk a lot home. Goodbye, okay, guys. I don't want to spend too much time here. Alright, Brandy's home. Let's see if we can serve some lunch. I don't know if we have any food. Oh, we do. Okay, great. Brandy is upset she'll be old and never married. I don't know, Brandy. Doesn't seem like it's gonna be happening for you, girl. I'm having Braxton prepare to stay up all night again. Oh yeah, the headmaster is supposed to be coming, so I guess we can uh, serve him that chili. Who are you booty calling? Johnny? Who the heck is Johnny? Johnny Fretzer? Was he one of those guys at the, uh, the place? The, oh my god, the, the campground? Yeah, you can pick that up then, Braxton. Oh my god, I think he is, and she just tried to flirt with him, and he's like, um, no. And she's like, okay. <laughs> Alright, here is the headmaster, so let's go greet him. Um, I guess Braxton will try to do the brunt of the, uh, work. We'll have him talk to the- because he's the one who wants to. So go chat with him. And, uh, we'll have Brandy just serve some- What's his favorite? Isn't it pork chops? I'll have him ser her serve some pork chops. Oh, never mind. We're out of food. <laughs> Alright, well, we'll just get some- Oh god, we actually do need food. Can I make the blackened catfish? Okay, we can do that. We'll make that, because she's got that in her inventory, I think. Brandy, you're burning it, you nerd! Oh my god, okay. Alright, well, let's call him for dinner. Is he stuck? Oh my god. This guy's just stuck! Hello? Vince? Are you good? And now he's gone. Okay, great. I'm glad that he broke. Now we gotta do it again. Now we gotta do that again tomorrow. Well, at least I can get some groceries tomorrow. I'm just gonna have Brandy go to bed. Come on, Braxton, you can do it! We can get abducted by aliens. All right, never mind. I guess we're not getting abducted by aliens. Man, this is really, really hard. All right, we need to go down to the grocery store and get some groceries. Today's our last day. We have to try to get Braxton in a, uh, um, in the private school. Not you. I don't want to. Okay, why? Who are you booty calling now? This dude. Stop booty calling him. We're not booty calling him. No, 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 no. We're gonna walk to lot community lot. He doesn't like you. We need to go to the grocery store, girl. We need to get some food. You can worry about that later. <laughs> right here, 290 Main Street. All right, let's go. 
I guess she's moved on from Darren because I guess she likes him instead. <laughs> and there it is again, the fear to have a baby. <laughs> Girl, I don't think you're going to have a baby. You're good. All right, let's get some groceries, please. All right, that's all I wanted. Now let's go home. We need to be ready to serve dinner again. I cannot believe that he glitched out. That was annoying. I hope he doesn't do it again. I feel bad for Braxton being in the red like this. Brandy's home. She's gonna put the groceries away. And then we need to pay back this loan. I paid a thousand dollar loan in her bank account. All right, and I did put the collar on Susie, so let's wash Susie now that we've gotten her all cleaned up. Oh my god, Braxton, stop kicking over the trash can. Your life sucks, I get it. Maybe if you wouldn't set unrealistic goals for yourselves. Just getting ready for the uh, headmaster once again. Hopefully he will come this time. And not break. Alright, a different one showed up, so we're gonna invite him in. We'll just let Brandy talk to him. We'll just chat with him. Did we break him too? He broke. He's broken. And he's gone. Alright, well... <laughs> Wow, okay, well, talking to him, I guess, breaks the guy. Oh my god. Who are you calling over for booty call? Braxton, you can't be serious. You can't call Carol. Braxton, no. Oh no, why are you calling Carol? That's Bo's girlfriend. Oh my god. Maybe Moody will keep him from actually booty calling her. Oh my god, I don't want to see this. I can't say no. I have to let my sims just do whatever they want. Wait. No, he's actually gonna flirt with her. Okay. Hopefully- Okay. She cancelled it by doing slap dance. Good. First kiss! ACS trying to get in on her! Just keep ignoring it, Carol. Keep slap dancing. <laughs> Go write an article or something. You wanna earn some money? Earn some money that way. I can't believe that the headmaster's broken. He literally takes one look at the trailer and he goes, um, no, I'm not going in there. He won't even step foot inside. He just, he just breaks outside every time. Never had that happen before. Listen to bragging. She's gonna brag to him. He's bragging about her family member getting married. Coral getting married the second time. Okay, Carol's leaving. I'm really glad the booty call didn't work. She literally totally ignored Braxton. <laughs> she was like, no, I'm not talking to you. I have a- uh, I wanted to slap dance instead. <laughs> Brandy has six days until she becomes an elder. Um, it is the end of the summer round, so this is the end of the round for the Brokes. Um, not much happened. I thought more would happen, but, uh, no. Nope. Nothing. Um... But Bo went off to college and we tried to invite the headmaster for uh, Braxton, um, but the headmaster's just broken and doesn't care and doesn't want Braxton. I guess he's working plotting against Braxton. He doesn't want him going to private school. Um, we're still working on this extraterrestrial grant, but it's getting kind of difficult. Um, Braxton is just not getting abducted by aliens. <laughs> um, but we did take them on the mountain vacation that Brandy wanted to take her sons on, so that that's uh, something that we did that was good. Um... In the next episode, we will be playing Darren, Cassandra, and their child, Kylie, and their soon-to-be-born child, uh, their second child, um, C Cassandra, is actually pregnant right now, so she will be uh, giving birth in three days' time when we play her. Um, so I can't wait to see their second baby. Um, as always, if you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and subscribe. I appreciate all the love and support, um, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you all again, and I'll see you later.